Hey everyone, I'm just gonna make a quick tutorial on how to fix the bad module info kick or crash S um, message. So basically what it is, is it's been caused by the one of the last uh, Windows 10 updates and it's a, a memory crash or memory error, I believe, but this is a quick fix on how to fix it and it works. So what you gotta do is go down to your game files. So you can either go to your, if you know where it's installed, it's usually installed program files, Steam, maps and it'll be common and then the mods will be in there but I don't have any mods there also if you don't uh, know where how to find them I know I have a skin on my um, Steam but you gotta right click the game you want it'll work with any skin so properties local fire files and then browse local files which is basically in my my F drive, which is my game SSD. So you gotta go Steam, Steam apps, common, to whatever game you want. So Arma 3 for that. So basically for this, uh, Arma 3 is really easy actually, because all their files are mainly in the startup folder, I guess you could say, or the directory. So what you all gotta do is find the launch programs. So Arma 3 and Arma 3 X64. So X64 is if you're running 64-bit in the game, or Arma 3 is just regular playing 32-bit. What you gotta do is right click, properties, go to compatibility, and then you must be, must have this checked off. So disable full screen optimizations. And this is what's causing the bad module info uh, crash. And I also like to run my games as administrator. So apply, okay, go for this version. Properties, compatibility, make sure it's checked, and apply and okay. So that'll fix it for Armor 3, but say if you're having an issue with PUBG. So I have it installed in my E drive, which is my HDD. So I gotta go to my game, Steam Apps, Common, PUBG, and then PUBG is a confusing folder. So what you gotta go is TSL Game, which is the actual name of the game. TSL Game, Binaries, Win64, and TSL Game. So now again, right click it properties, compatibility, and make sure disable full screen optimizations are checked. And then again, I like to run my games administrator. That's why that's checked. So disable full screen optimizations and then do the same for battle eye, which is the anti-cheat. Just, just in case anything happens with that, you don't want to get kicked for battle eye or anti-hack anti not working. Make sure that's all checked. So once all of this is checked, everything should be working and you shouldn't get the crash error anymore. So hopefully this tutorial worked for you guys and because I know it worked for me and I hope you guys enjoyed. Works, see ya.